Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're having a great day. Um, today's video, I'm going to be filming a review. Um, not of a product of a film. It's um, on Sunday there because it was December weekend where I lived, and me and my mum have been wanting to see this film for ages. You'll know what the film is by the title anyway. But I decided to share this because it's quite. This has never happened to us before, and I decided to share you story anyway, okay? So we went to see Bridget Jones's Baby, we seen the trailer, we loved the first two and we were dying to see this. It was even funny laughing at the trailer. So, um, so obviously here's the tickets, right, that's nothing special, just me and my mum. My dad did offer to come but he didn't want to come, so talk to my dad. But anyway, um, so we went in, right, got tickets, got sweets and juice and blah 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 blah. And, and got seated. Now, it was the film started. I'm not going to tell in the happens in the film. Like I don't want to spoil it for you who so are maybe going to see it tomorrow or the next day or I've still to see it. But um, I'll give you like wee hints if you know what I mean. So this film, I would out of five stars, I'd give it a five. Um, I went to the local view. And, right, so halfway through the film, which was, in my opinion, one of the most important parts of the film because we want to hear Bridget tell and Mark and Jake, Jack? Mark and Jack, you'll know who they are if you've watched the first two. You won't know who Jack is because he only comes in it in this one. Um, so anyway, so she's in, Bridget's in the middle of telling them what happened at the music festival. Um, going to leave that in a cliffhanger for you guys. Um, everyone that's happened, and then they're going to tell. Uh, now, first we thought, oh, it's part of the film, doing it for audio. Maybe not might hear this bit, but then it dragged on, and we we're like, no, this is too long for it to be part of the film. And then they started playing Ghostbusters tune. And they were like, who are you going to call? <laughs> right, obviously classic. Um, and the girl next to us actually said, well, hopefully an engineer, right? <laughs> so we were all laughing at that. Um, but it turns out it wasn't the only, like, our film wasn't the only one that cut out the sound. Apparently they had a massive sound problem or something. I can't even mind the word the guy used. Um, so I had a massive problem in the whole cinema and at that certain bit in Eddie's film, the sound went. We got it fixed, we did see the rest of it, and we were all like, well, at least rewind it to where we missed out. And they're like, no, we can't because it would have mucked up all the other times for all the other showings of all the other films, right? And then my, my mum's like, well, how are you going to solve this issue? And he's like, I'll give you two or three cinema tickets. I'll give you cinema free cinema tickets for the next time you hear you see any film, blah, 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 blah. So he gave us, but a lot of people walked out and never complained, which... Me and my mum said it was quite stupid, like, why would you not walk out after you've paid for that movie and not even seen 10 minutes, maybe? Like, 5, 10 minutes yet? Fair enough, it's only 5, 10 minutes out of an hour and a bit, but that's really not the point, you paid for it, you should get the full movie. Um. Anyway, so, a lot of people walked out and then, obviously we all got free tickets. I've not got the free tickets to show me, my dad's got them, because he really wants to see, I think it's Magnificent Seven, Um. I could be wrong. I think that's me, him and my mum are going to see. And I don't really want to see it. I did get a choice to go, but I don't really want to see it. So, it's like, I just brought me a ticket and like, it's like a free ticket to any movie, any time, and it's got no expiration date. Expiry date? Expiration? Whatever word. Um, basically, it doesn't go out of date. You can use a ticket in maybe 2020, for instance, or next year, or next month. It's like, you know what I mean? So, it's, so the film was amazing, bar that wee bit that we missed. Kindly get the just of which we should be seen, but like it's still not the same. And I just want to say if you ever experience something like that, I do think you should actually go to a manager um, and just complain and they'll end up giving you some type of solution to solve, to suit your problem. Maybe the picture went or you could still hear the sound and there was no picture displayed. Something like that. Don't know what kind of problems can go wrong, but 
I just wanted to give you th my thoughts on the movie. It was funny, it was so much better than the first two films. Um, the ending was my absolute fave. I'm not going to tell you what happened because I'm going to spoil it as I said, but I look so low down. Look. That hurts my back. I've got a sore back, guys. Um, sorry for the lack of videos as well. I'm not going to be doing video about this list anymore. I'll finish what I've seen first, right? So yeah, I thought the ending was really good and um, overall I thought it was a fantastic film. I do recommend you go see it. It is a 15. Just let me point that out there. It is a 15. So maybe if you're 13, they might ask you for ID. Like, if you're 13 but you'll look as if you passed for 15, you'll still get ID'd. I got ID'd one time. I didn't get ID'd this time, but I did get ID'd one time. I wasn't allowed in to see... Um, can't remember what it was, but I wasn't allowed in to see it. I think it was Ted, because that was a 15 and I was only like 14 at the time, but I look 15 anyway, so it's kind of fine. And my dad was there and he's like, she's with me, I'm allowing her to go in. I wasn't allowed in anyway, right? So I went up somewhere else, but that's not my problem. So yeah, I do recommend you go see it if you're a big fan of Bridget Jones. If you're a big fan, you've probably already seen it by now. I meant to film this video on Sunday, but then I was, I even only remember what happened Sunday, like, I think maybe cousins come over from, I never really got time to sit and finish on Sunday, and then Monday I was still off school because it was September weekend obviously, and I was kind of chill, relaxed day away, obviously, my mum, and my dad was, no he was off as well, and we just had a really chill kind of day, watching TV and stuff. And um, so yeah, I've just decided on Tuesday, which was yesterday, I was I was back at school and I had a lot of homework to catch up on because I got sent home Thursday because I hurt my wrist. <laughs> um, so yeah, the film is amazing. I do recommend you go see it if you haven't already. And you can let me know in the comments your thoughts about the film, if any of this can happen to you, or blah 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 blah. So, in the end, we did get two free tickets to go and see any movie we want at any given time. And the Bridget Jones film was amazing. And we were definitely going to buy the DVD copy anyway. And we will rewatch it probably over and over and over again. But that's not the point. We're getting it. So I thought to share this experience with you, because maybe you've experienced the same thing. Maybe not with this movie, but with a different movie. And I just thought to point out if any problems do go wrong during your film to go to a manager or one member of staff or something just to complain about it because it is your money you're paying to see and you don't actually get to see a film which is, to, to me it's completely unfair. So that is that over and with. I'd give it a 5 out of 5 star rating. Um, And now I'm going to be saying what I was saying halfway through it and I shouldn't have done that. So that is the review over. If you don't want to hear this next bit, which is basically just about why I've hardly uploaded, then you can just exit out of the video. But anyway, so why I've hardly uploaded this month, I don't really know why I've hardly uploaded this month. Um, because I don't really think of video ideas, like, and I have been really, really busy with family stuff and... I just haven't really had time to sit and film and I haven't really had a great idea either. We are nearly, this is the 28th I believe. Yeah, this is the 28th of September. This will be uploaded right after it's finished. I'm going to edit it quickly and get it uploaded for you tonight. So, yeah, so I, I, that's basically why I've hardly uploaded. I'm not going to be doing any more video about this list, like, all the videos planned for that month. I'm just going to make it a surprise now. So you don't know what videos are coming in October or November or December. Obviously December will be a Christmas so you gather that. I'm not bragging about it. There's will, there will be a Christmas wish list this year. I know I never... This year? This year. I know I never done one last year. Um, just because I don't really know what to ask for and I just really asked mum and dad to surprise me and stuff. And yeah. So I've done a Christmas list this year and I'll be definitely filming that for you when my phone's charged because I need to film on my phone because my list is actually on my iPad and it's like a big screen anyway so yeah 
so that's why I finally uploaded. Hopefully, October will have more of a more video content. I do love filming. Like I, I don't know why. It's just kind of what I like to do. Um, what a wee hobby kind of thing. Maybe one day I'd like to take it serious. I do take this serious. I don't mean that. I meant like maybe one day this will become my job. I don't know. Um. I'm just going to obviously see where life takes me. But if you enjoyed this Bridget Jones's baby film review, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Comment below if you've experienced the same thing with maybe another film or if you enjoyed this film and blah, 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 blah. All the rights, copies, blah, 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 go to all the owners or, or the creators, whoever helped make this movie successful. Um, just saying. Like, so, this video's done like a band, basically. So, yeah, if you enjoyed, please like, comment, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any new videos. Bye!